This is Fedora 20 Linux on a Pentium 4 computer. Uh, Linrod is installed here since before, but it was for uh, the frame buffer device and no libraries for different hardware has been installed yet. So now I will install all the libraries that Linrod might want to use. Uh, first, set user root. And the Linrod installation is here. So here are the the source code files for Lindrad. Uh, I run the configure script and it will tell what packages are missing. A lot of packages could be installed so I will install them in this video and tell a little bit about what they are and why to install them. To do that I run configure with help. That will give installation instructions. Uh, this was installed for the frame buffer device so there is no support for X11. To get that and we are in Fedora, we have this command, copy and paste, yes, And then uh, configure with help again. Uh, the libx ext allows a faster uh, graphics in communication with the uh, Xelva server. Uh, for Fedora, it is this command: copy and paste. Yes. And configure with help once more. LibUSB. There isn't really any reason to install that. Uh, but I do it anyway. Uh, so I don't have to read this on the screen anymore. Copy and paste. Sorry. Copy, paste. The libUSB is now obsolete and we are using libUSB slash uh, yes, libUSB 1.0 uh, instead. But Linrod can use either one and you can select that from the uh, uh, from a configuration file. Now for the Perseus we need to install the Perseus library which can be found at uh, some location on the internet. To do this conveniently, I open one more terminal window here, su and it doesn't matter where I'm logged at the moment, 
I just take this set of commands, uh, copy and paste here, paste, and now the installation of the Perseus library goes on. It goes from source code, so there is some compilation involved. So, run configure with help again. The PCIe 9842 is a special thing. It's a PCE a card, PCE Express card and the drivers for this are only available for a couple of Linux versions today. That will hopefully change in the future, but I will not install it uh, today. Uh, but uh, the libudev uh, is in the required for the fun cube, and that's a uh, popular hardware, so we need this. Copy and, sorry, with the full command, copy and paste. Yes. And again, configure with help. Uh, the lib Miri SDR, that's for the Mirix USB dongle. Uh, we install it this way. Copy, and I and paste. So now we have a complaint. There is no CMake on this system. So we have to install that uh, in install. Yes. <laughs> so once again, try the command from the configure script. And it seems to work now. So go back here and uh, try again. Configure with help. It will be easier to make the screen bigger. Lib blade RF is not present. Uh, install like that. Copy and paste. So it's built again from source code. And back here and again, configure with help. Uh, 
the RTL 2832 dongles are popular and quite good so we need support for them copy and paste And it's again compilation from source code. And everything is quite automatic. Back here, uh, uh, run the configure with help, and libftdi. It's needed for the Soft 66 and for the Elector. Those are hardwares I don't have. I never tried them myself, but as far as I know, this should work. So we copy the instructions and paste it into here. Paste. could have used the this one to install the uh, Fedora version of libftdi I was a little bit too quick now anyway we installed it from source and that's also okay configure with help uh, the soft 66 code copy and paste so there was something wrong with libftdi this is one of the things varying between linux distributions I have installed libftdi, but the soft 66 didn't find it. Uh, I can try to install the uh, Fedora thing. Again, try the soft 66, copy, paste. So, I don't know uh, how to handle this. So, this installation will be without soft 66. Under other Linux distributions, it works. But in this case, it doesn't work, and it's probably not difficult to fix it. But that's not the purpose of this video. So I go on. So we again run configure with help.
and soft 66 did not work, but we have other things. Um, Jack is a package that allows Linrad to send audio to various other programs. Uh, this is a modern version of Fedora, so it is probably okay to install the uh, package that comes with Fedora. So, uh, paste. Yes. And again, configure with help. Port audio. We could do it from source code, uh, but this is a modern version, so maybe it works also from the package maintainer copy and paste. Yes. And again, configure with help. And now the only missing things are libsoft66, which doesn't work in this distribution, and the libwd dask for the Adlink card that we have to register with Adlink to get, and we cannot get for this particular version of Linux. So now we can compile. Make so we have Xlinrad, and on this computer the frame buffer is okay, so I can compile, compile Flinrad as well. So, uh, now uh, we have support for all the hardware uh, except for Soft 66.